Is your Windows 10 search not working properly? We will show you a few methods that are sure to get you up and searching in no time. And if you stay with us until the end, we'll share a bonus tip for backing up your files on Windows. So let's get started. The first and simplest solution is to restart your computer. Click the Windows button, select the power option, and choose restart. If the issue persists, we can move on to more advanced solutions. If it is still not working after the restart, open settings, select update and security, and choose troubleshoot. Click on additional troubleshooters, and select search and indexing, then click on run the troubleshooter. Follow the prompts and instructions to diagnose and fix the problem. Another solution is to use the system file checker. Click on the Windows menu, and scroll down the list of apps until you see the Windows system folder. Right-click on the command prompt and select Run as Administrator. In the window that appears, type in SFC scan now and press the Enter key. Let the program verify the system and follow the on-screen instructions. If the program doesn't find any issues, try force closing Cortana. Right-click on the taskbar, select Task Manager, and locate Cortana in the list. Right-click on it and select End Task. Now, look for the search feature, right-click on it, and select End Task as well. Go back to the home screen and try using the search function again. You can also try restarting Windows Explorer. Go back to the Task Manager window and search for Windows Explorer in the list. Right-click on it and select Restart. You should also check your antivirus software if it is not blocking this feature. Locate your antivirus software in your system tray at the bottom right corner, right-click on it, and look for an option like Disable or Pause Protection. Now, try using the search to see if it solves the problem. You can also ensure that Windows Search is on by pressing the Windows key and the R button simultaneously. Then type services.msc in the Run window, click OK, scroll down to Windows Search, and double-click on it. If the service status appears as stopped, press the Start button, and set the Startup Type drop-down menu to Automatic. A final option is to rebuild indexing. Click the Start button and look for the Control Panel. Click on it and search for indexing options in the search bar at the top right corner. Click on it, and then click on the Advanced button. In the Troubleshooting section, press the Rebuild button. If all else fails, a factory data reset could provide a fresh start. Click on the Windows Start button, open the Settings, click on Update and Settings, and select Recovery in the left sidebar. Under Reset this PC, click on Get Started and follow the provided instructions. And as a token of appreciation for staying until the end, here's how to back up your files on Windows 10. Click the Windows Start button, select the Control Panel, choose System and Security, and click on Backup and Restore. On the left-hand side, click Create a System Image, and choose the disk where you'd like to store the backup. Ensure that your external drive is connected. If it's not detected automatically, select it from the drop-down menu and click Next. Review your disk selections, then click Start Backup to begin the process. Wait for the progress bar to complete. Once finished, Windows will suggest creating a system repair point. This is a proactive measure in case Windows encounters critical errors or fails to start properly. Choosing no won't affect your original backup. That's it. Thank you for watching, and if you found this video helpful, check out our full playlist of tutorials about Windows.